Police are calling this mystery man a hero. Citizens have taken to calling him a superhero brick man. Crime boss Virgil Gerbens, a.k.a. Uncle Virgil, is believed to be hiding in Lodo. Who's brick man? Go ask your mom. Okay, fine. I have an idea. I will be Brickman, and you will be Uncle Virgil. Girls can't be heroes. <sighs> Why not? You're smart, but you don't have any muscles. Do too! Do not! <sighs> How's it going, ladies? Mom cut up some apples. Playing superhero, and I'm Brickman. Emma Jen doesn't have any muscle, so she can't be Brickman. Anyone can be a hero, Molly. Not just boys. Brains and heart are more important than muscle. How do you know so much about heroes? Huh? Are you kidding me? I'm the leader of the Super Villain Club. Those heroes ain't got nothing on us villains. You can't even squish a fly. We know where Uncle Virgil is. Molly! How do you know that? Imogen figured it out. She's really smart. Fine, 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 okay, okay. He was using an unsecure signal to use GPS tracking for all his shipments, and I sort of kind of maybe hacked into the ham radio. Imogen, that's really wonderful, but... This was the last place the signal came from. Look, girls, it's really great that you're learning about GPS and network security at your age. But promise me you're not going to go after him. He's a very bad man, so don't do anything silly, okay? Don't worry. We're not stupid. And the Arvada shipment? Brickman. Brickman blew up the truck. Damn it! Well, what about the shipment for Aurora? Oh, uh, well, um... We think it's at the bottom of Cherry Creek Reservoir. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am very, very disappointed! What am I paying you two fools for? Boss, we had ten men guarding the truck. I had three small plane decoys. Wonderful. Uh, brilliant, even. And yet, I have no shipment. Rocky, what did I tell you last time? You... Baker, let's refresh Rocky's memory. What did I tell you to last time? Yeah, well, what you said was um, there would be consequences if we failed. Results have consequences. Looks like we have some young interlopers. Well, go get them, boys! Didn't your mom ever tell you it's not nice to listen in on other people's business? We didn't hear anything. We were just playing superhero. That's right, Uncle Virgil. So, you know who I am. And, uh, what's your name? Hmm? I'm Molly, and that's Emma Chen. She's really smart, so don't do anything stupid. Is that so? <laughs> okay, smartass. So how'd you find me? Followed your stench, led all the way here. Who knows you're here? Everybody, the police will be here in minutes. Unlikely. My sources would have told me by now. Unfortunately for you, it's time for some school. Do you think this is some kind of game, little girl? This isn't Hollywood.
At last, I've unmasked my arch nemesis. And to think this whole time it was a little girl. <sighs> that was some trick. See what happens when you play hero? People get hurt. I'm just trying to make a buck here. Why do you have to rain on my parade, Kara? It's Kara, right? Who is the government to tell us what to do with our own bodies? Is that how you sleep at night? Convince yourself that you're saving society when you're the monster tearing it apart? <laughs> so, cannabis is okay. But a little bit of hope comes in, and oh, let's roll out the army. So you see, Kara? I'm just a man of the people, trying to uphold our cherished natural-born liberties, which the government is so carelessly trampling. Molly, don't you dare close your eyes. Look at me, Molly. And all in the guise of what? Keeping our streets safe? They've made me what I am. And when I'm gone, someone just like me will take my place. You're just one person, Kara. But we are unstoppable. No! Why don't you do it? Molly wouldn't want this. That's a good girl. Now give me a hand up. This isn't Hollywood. Hollywood. 